Hello, Asalaamu Alaikum and uh, I am Muneeb. Today my video is about the coronavirus. But before I start, I want you to please subscribe the channel and support it by giving informative links or commenting it so that the channel can flourish more and get more ideas for further videos. Because this channel is uh, mostly based on uh, on on Islamic topics so, and uh, it's very if I could say new for a child to make such a way to make such a channel just to spread words of Islam for the people as most children don't even dare to do this or they just do it concentrated on playing games and this is not good at all for Islam because now the word of Allah and the word of our Prophet is slowly slowly disappearing so please you can help us by subscribing the channel and teaching your children what is Islam by just showing this video or the many videos they are inside of the channel. So let us continue. Now, I am in Italy, which is the city of Bologna, Emilia Romagna. And if you know, Italy was in before in the headlines of one of the worst trade areas in the world. It has more than 130,000 cases and more than 10,000 deaths. This is the summary if you want to say something is really bad. But what's happening? Italy is under state of lockdown since now about one month, but the regions in the north are more than about are about to reach two months of lockdown, about to reach. And uh, schools are also closed and they are supposed to be closed according to some officials till the end of September or in the middle of it and also the situation now the economy which of Italy is uh, thinking to slowly slowly reopen by the beginning of May because the coronavirus cases are now slowing down but for education right now the government is distributing laptops and also internet accessories for their children of course the government people so the teachers can also connect with the children and so they can stay in touch with the class and don't lose their academic years also all kinds of exams will be done in this procedure while for the older people who cannot leave their homes and they are more and more susceptible for deadlier versions of this virus the people of the government such as ngos caritas red cross they are providing food on their doorsteps by the help of uh, by the help of ambulances or even taxis. This has been reported in Rome, or even on cycles. This has also been reported, and for the economy because Italy was before this in a bit of a strangle for the economical crisis. Italy has now given about four hundred billion euros, which is about a bit more than the whole GDP of Pakistan, for encouraging the people to keep in the investing in our country in Italy so that the economy should not go into recession this is what is happening but what about the cure the cure is some doctors say a long way and the vaccination there are, there are many variations of this but there's no one main vaccine which is thought to kill the coronavirus because of this we need to take precautionary measures against this like washing our hands always one of the best ways to stay to keep ourselves safe i'm not saying this is verified but it's a good way because if you do wudu you clean your hands about six times and not only once you drink it five times a day it can save you even if you had the germs on your hands it can save you but and even if you don't do this Please, if you touch anything, don't touch your mouth or your eyes or your nose. And if you are sick, you don't need to be panicked. Most of the cases which are infected are only mild, not severe. So, don't get panicked because panicking is more worse than the virus itself. Now, what to do in this time? We are all at home, all isolated. Then why not remember Allah? Pray to Him as Ramzan is already nearing. If you pray to Him, 
anything can happen. If no medicine works, Allah's dua will always work. It is said by a prophet again and again and again. So please pray to Allah, don't waste this time in playing video games or sitting around. Rather use this time for prayers, or reading the Quran, understanding it. As most people from our countries like Pakistan and India read the Quran, but they don't know anything what it means. So please read the translation, know what it means, and please, please, please spend as much time uh, for dua. Please share the video and like it as well so we can make more videos like this. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum Hania. Aapne jo hume Surah Rahman ke baare mein pataya hai, wo ham sunte hain aur ham puri koshish karte hain ki ham uski tilawat bhi sunen aur Kanora virus ki safety ka jo aapne pataya ham puri koshish karte hain ki ham usko follow kare aur aap sab bhi ghar mein rahe aur apni life bachaye ghar mein baith ke. Assalamu alaikum Hania. I hope कि आप ठीक होएंगी। आपने जो हमें सुरे रहमान बताई थी, हमने वो अपने घर घरों में लगाना और पढ़ना शुरू कर दिया जिजा करा। Assalamu alaikum Hania Abi. I hope you are fine. Thank you for telling us about coronavirus. We listen Surah Al Rahman in our home daily. And we do zikr of astaghfar. Jazakallah. May Allah give you best words. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Assalamu alaikum Hani Abi. Hamne apki video leki. Aap kaise hain? Surah Man Sunna. Meri Allah Taala se dua hai ki Corona virus jaldi se khatam ho jaye. Main Allah Taala ki baat sunta hu. Amin. Hani Abi, aapne bahut achhi baatein kari hai. Allah Taala ham sabko apni hifazat mein rakhe. Amin. अल्लाह ताला अपने खुलाने आए खत्म हो जाए जब अपनी मोमक सब सोना है और और पार्टियां भी करनी है अस्सलाम वालेकुम हाली आपी अच्छा आप कैसी हैं मैंने आपकी वीडियो देखी अल्लाह ताला तो क्यों ना आया तो थोड़े मेरी दुआ है हानी आप मुझे बहुत वीडियोस मैकिंग मुझे आप बहुत अच्छी लगती है